Am I the a-hole for kicking my parents out of my place after my mom gave me the silent treatment? I have 31 live on another continent away from my parents. We have a rocky relationship because my mother is controlling and throws fits when she doesn't get her way. My dad is unfortunately an enabler and goes for it's your fault. You should apologize for upsetting your mother every time. Recently, they came to stay in my 400 SKU F studio apartment with me, despite me saying they might be more comfortable in a hotel. For cultural reasons Asian family, my mom thinks that she needs to rearrange my kitchen and cook food for me, she gives me no choice in this and that I should be grateful and revert to the powerlessness of my childhood. For example, she decides what I eat for every meal, I get questioned about when I'm leaving the house and when I'm coming back etc. I came home from work yesterday and the water was out without warning. I got slightly upset as my landlord has been guilty of doing this kind of thing before, without 24 hour notice. As I was putting in the work order, I muttered under my breath about how annoying it was and I was clearly frustrated. My mom started telling me to calm down, why do I always get so worked up about these things? Things. I was already frustrated, so I said calmly, don't tell me to calm down. I have the right to be upset about this. My feelings are valid. I did not raise my voice. My mom hates when I say things like this, so she responded by throwing whatever she was holding to the ground and giving me the silent treatment. Before she started that she said, well, I have the right to feel many things too. How dare you talk to me that way? Then gave me the silent treatment for the rest of the night, including refusing to eat dinner. This morning, they left for a short trip but will be coming back to stay with me later. As we were waiting for the taxi, I asked my mom a little incredulously if she was going to continue giving me the silent treatment when she came back. She didn't respond. I said, this is the one time I'm going to bring it up. I'm not going to keep asking about it. There's not much point in coming to visit me if you're going to ignore me the whole time. My mom then said, fine, then we won't stay with you when we get back. We'll make alternate arrangements. My dad Dad started lying to me about how it's my fault because I was upset and I upset her yesterday by throwing a tantrum and now I was trying to her into speaking to me. So I said, if you really feel that way, then maybe you should think about whether you want to stay with me when you get back. Am I the a-hole for saying this? Here are the top comments, plus Opie's reply. Not the a-hole. Do they have a key? If they do change the locks and be away from home when they get into town, your relationship may be better without the stress of them staying with you. Maybe offer to take them out to dinner at a restaurant of their choice. OP replied. I also think staying separately would be better for our relationship. The problem is, they are absolutely against the idea and see it as a betrayal of family values. And a confirmation that I've become too Americanized after living here for eight years. Not the a-hole. Don't let cultural reasons dictate your life. You are not living in the past. You're living in the present. Don't let your dad continue to enable your mother. Grow a spine and do more than kindly suggest they find alternate arrangements. Tell them the actual truth of their behaviors.